Thank you, Dennis. Our top story tonight, thousands of dollars missing from a youth football league's bank account. A police investigation leaves the president of that league in handcuffs. Yeah, Isabel Rosales has the exclusive interview with the new president now in charge of cleaning things up. A youth football league's bank account nearly wiped out and Clearwater police say it's this woman, the former president, who did it. It's heartbreaking. It's a family member. It's not just the president of a league. Rick Millian is the new president of the Countryside Junior Cougars, now in charge of cleaning up the mess. His predecessor, Carissa Polks, was the only one with access to the league's account. Police say for over a year, she stole nearly $30,000. Board members kept asking for financials, kept asking for access to the bank account, um, and they just weren't getting it. After too many red flags, they called Clearwater Police. According to police, she used that stolen money to pay for her cable bill, her car insurance, for tickets to baseball and football games, and for a shopping trip to Victoria's Secret. Nearly 250 kids were left with no option but to use old uniforms and gear to get them through the start of the season. If the parents are affected a little bit financially, that's okay, but we can't let it affect the kids because some of them, this is all they have right now. And thanks to donations, their new uniforms just got here this week. Despite that, Million says this theft will leave them playing catch up for years. One person should never have enough power to be able to do this by themselves again. They hope new changes in how they handle and view finances will make sure it doesn't. In Clearwater, Isabel Rosales, ABC Action News.